am back with yet another video. I was a little sidelined there, but I am back for you on this Friday. And we have a team talk, right, Jordan? That's what we got today? Yep. We have team talk electric outboard. Electric outboard team talk. This is gonna be kind of good. Um, lots of things going around about electric outboards. Lots of companies building them. We picked one. We picked Vision, correct, Jordan? We went with Vision just because I think they give the most info on their website. Their website's probably the best. They do the most info. They answer everything correctly. Highest horsepower. Highest horsepower even. Hell yes, this is gonna be great. All right, Vision Marine Technologies team talk starting now. Here we go, all right. Vision Marine Technologies is a global leader in electric, I'm just reading this people. I'm just reading this right now, all right? An electric recreational boating industry service or serving both OEMs and consumers. Uh, is the business of designing and manufacturing electric outboards, powertrain systems, and our related, te uh, related technologies. Vision Marine sells 100% electric outboards. Outboard motors, it says. The technology to the marine industry via our retail e-commerce website, rental boats, rental boat companies, uh, and other OEMs. That's it, that's what we got. Is that like they're induct and that's how they introduce themselves? Yeah. This is our deal, this is what we do, gotcha. All right, e-motion powertrain system. That's what they're powering with, right? The e-motion, it's like, it kind of sounds like a song, doesn't it? Like the e-motion song? Get in my e-motion. Mm -hmm. Sorry, my bad. Anyway, the e-motion system is 180 horsepower. So it's 180 horsepower outboard yep. that you can't even hear run. It just is as silent as a mosquito. Mm. All right. It got 70 kilowatt hour power bank, dual 35 batteries. That's what it's running. You put them in the boat? I'm just gonna go through this, and then we'll just start talking about it, okay, Jordan? Warranty, keep this in mind, people. The e-motion powertrain and components has a two-year recreational warranty, a one-year commercial. So if you're a commercial guy, you get No? I only get a year. I think they do that with everybody. You only get one year. Uh, the dual 35 kilowatt hour batteries are three years, the two years for commercial, or limit 600 charging cycles. 600 to get you going. All right. <sighs> E-motion powertrain. The e-motion powertrain technology provides what we believe to be the only scale production ready, high performance electric outboard for watercraft. That's not we, that's them saying that. We don't, we don't know that yet. Um, but it's basically a high performance watercraft. This mode, the e-motion is. So it's it's the performance electric outboard. All right, next generation touchscreen, a complete integrated uh, propulsion and battery management system perfectly suitable for for demanding recreational boaters all managed in one touch screen so we can just go in and touch and tell them what we're doing is that what, how it works Jordan yep. so like if I got a 15 foot boat I can beep 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 oh, touch screen. it is yep. right on the outboard or is this on the that'd be, your, at, that'd be at your dash dash console no tiller handles nope. everything's remote so it'll be up by the dash, you can tell it what you got it on. Yep. And it knows what to do. Yep. Okay. A picture of it right here. Right here? Yep. There's a picture of it right now? Yep. Right over here. Yep. Awesome. Nice job. <clears throat> All right. Shore outlet compatible. Battery management system uh, can charge at 220 volt. Meter. Yeah, that's perfect. So it's a 220. You can plug it in at any of your marinas. You can float it and plug it in. Here's our favorite thing, the FAQ. Neil, you know what FAQ is? what I figured. Frequently asked questions. That's what that is. All right. How long to charge? Uh, you can fully charge batteries overnight. You can plug it in overnight just like the rest of the world, right? It's just like a normal boat. You can plug it in overnight, it'll be charged. All right. What is the size and type of the boats recommended for the E-Motion 180E? The E-Motion 180E outboard can be fitted to any watercraft 18 to 26 feet. Anything doesn't matter if it's a tuner, doesn't matter if it's a tin, doesn't matter if it's a bass boat, doesn't matter walleye boat, offshore boat, doesn't matter. If it's 18 to 26, you're dropping this on. Okay. What is the estimated range of the E 180E, Jordan? Our estimated range is about 70 miles at cruising speed of 20. Cruising speed of 20, Jordan? Yeah, that's the problem. 20 miles an hour? Yep. That's cruising speed in my 18-foot bass boat? Yep. 
at three and a half hours. Factor depends on type of boat, weather, conditions, load, and prop. And that's a problem also. Okay. What are the benefits of electric power? Nothing. Come on, read it. What does it mean when Mason comes out of the bathroom and goes, <laughs> what the hell? All right, our electric outboard provides the captain with response, uh, what response in this? That should not, what? That is not felt with traditional engines. So you got like responsiveness that is just right there. Like instant go, attack, cruising at 20 miles an hour. That's getting it done. Electric power is more available on our waterways today than gasoline. What? Yeah. What? Yeah. What do you mean? We're not talking trolling motors. You're going to be able to pull up. I don't care. To the dock yep. And it's going to have power. I don't. But I, gas. why do I need to pull up? Because my batteries are going dead, and I got to run my charge my boat, or do I have a gas motor that I can make it through pool and go to the next pool because I got 50 top, gallons. Top to the bottom. I, I can go top to the bottom on gasoline or guarantee it. Um, which will only increase in years to come. Did you write that in there? That's what they say. You yeah, are. I think that's an important point. Because you're this electric guy and you, you're just sitting back there hating me doing my video like this right now. Uh, what about maintenance, Jordan? There is no maintenance. There's no scheduled maintenance. When the lithium blows up, you're fucking dead. That's simple. I mean, when the lithium blows, you go. No. Perfect. Uh, what is included in the powertrain package? The engine battery pack, you get a BMS, you get a charger, monitor, throttle controls, other components needed to power the boat are included in the E-Motion 180. That's what you get. I called these guys. Not those guys. I, didn't, I emailed these guys then. These guys, who did I email? Oh, that guy was a dick. Why is he a dick? Because he kept sending me this stupid email about, well, if you're not going to be a dealer, I don't want to talk to you or something like that. Oh, that's all right. I don't need that shit. Yeah. Anyway, can I convert my current, because we wanted to do a video on his stuff. Yeah. And I sent that email out like three times or two times, and he sent back, well, here's your price to be a dealer. I said, I don't want to be a dealer. I want to do a video on your company so people, and then he's like, well, I want dealers, and I'm like, all right, can I convert my current ice boat to the E-Motion electric powertrain? In short, yes, you could. Your E-Motion will soon be available through OEM manufacturers only. We do not currently sell to direct customers. Perfect, so I can, I can hook it up to my ice boat pretty soon. What ice boat? Like my scratcher motor? Picker, that one? Turn off the motion engine. Okay, all right. Here's the facts, 25 years in the boating industry, that's what they got. Vision Marine Technologies, uh, VMAR on the NASDAQ, is the leading in innovation of the traditional boating market. Manufactured 100% electric boats, producing zero emissions, keeping the natural environment completely clean. High point right there, everybody's clean with this motor. Uh, the producer of the world's most powerful electric outboard engine, the E-Motion 180E. The E-Motion 180E is the most technically advanced outboard motor in the market today and it cruises at 20 miles an hour okay the e-motion 180 is the world's first 180 horsepower that cruises at 20 miles an hour uh designed with complete propulsion package including throttle control and monitor so you get the throttle control and the monitor that you see vision marines bruce 22 is powered by e-motion uh it is the fastest production electric outboard at a mile per hour speed record of 109 that's the Bruce. So it went 109 miles an hour for 10 feet, and then shut off, or? No, I didn't. That's right. <laughs> okay. Uh, Vision Marine is the only electric manufacturer to use lithium batteries. Uh, the only electric boat company to offer a long duration warranty and a high technology products. All right. That's it. That's what you got here, Jordan. I love it. All right, so here we go. We're on kind of like final thoughts, I think. Is that where we're at, Jordan? Yeah. Let's talk about this thing. Um, I personally am not a fan of electric. Jordan knows this. I think that's why he gave me this video. Um, I'm a fan of smoke and motors that use gasoline. But is this going to happen? It's going to happen. I, we said that a while ago. That's how Avenger should have came back. They should have been building this. 
They should have been having this out and they should have had the coolest Evinrude ever. The E as the electric side, you know, you could have had the E of Evinrude instead of just and getting rid of Evan Rude, you could have the E with a little lightning bolt and some cool stuff that goes on, but that didn't happen. But these guys, I think, have a quality product from what I'm understanding. It's just that I don't agree with some of the... I'm not a fan of cruising at 20 miles an hour if I'm cruising. I'm cruising at 40, 45, you know what I mean? Yeah, laid back like Neil is back there. I, it's just, I don't foresee it doing anything to a 26 foot boat that has a V style hull. It's gonna be a heavy boat. I don't think it's gonna perform like you need it to. I don't need to be in my 26 foot boat running wide open and not and getting passed by a guy in a tin boat with a 50 horse tiller. I just don't wanna do that. Yeah, granted it's great for the, it's great for the world. We're not polluting, we're not doing any of that stuff. Um, but if I'm running 20 miles an hour for three and a half hours, that doesn't get me through a tournament day. It just won't work at this point. They need longevity. We need to be able to go for top of pool seven through pool nine and come back because we can do that with an outboard. We need to be able to do them kinds of things with this stuff. Um, and we need more power. We need to be able to go faster. There's no reason why they can't wind this thing out. We should be able to put like a 40 inch propeller on this thing and make this thing just zoom down the creek. Um, you know, I, I've always said that if we're gonna do this stuff and the, the boat companies have, or the motor company has to work with a boat company to be able to make the highest quality. So you take the gas tank out, thunk, throw that in the garbage, throw your lithiums in where the gas tank goes, and then where the motor plugs in to the comm harness to talk, that just unplugs and we just plug into there and now we're charging our boat and then when we go we replug and there you go. So we need to stack them batteries in there so we get longevity. Lithiums don't weigh shit. I mean if you do the math on 50 gallons of gas and how much that weighs over how many lithiums we can pile in there to equal that up. Granted the weight's not going to go away like it does in, with fuel which makes us go faster with less but the fact is is that you're going to always be the same. We need to achieve 70 miles an hour plus right in that ballpark in bass boat world and it needs to be 70 miles an hour because the cool part is that at 70 we can stay at 70 but we can fish for five or six hours of run time because you never know how far of a run you're going to have to have when that happens i may be on board with this but at this point i'm not on board so um i'm not a fan of it maybe you guys are i don't know you can comment we want you to comment on this correct jordan we want to hear what you say this will be this will be my time to be like see jordan i told you so because when you guys say uh no i'm not doing this until i'm forced to do it then yeah, I'll be like, see Jordan, told you so. Uh, but the fact of the matter is, is Jordan has a definite, definite deal here. And I'm doing the video because we want America to note that electric's coming, electric's here, and it, where are you at with it? We wanna know where you're at. Vision, if you're watching this, if somehow this gets to Vision Marine, send one to me or come here. Come here and show me these things. Bring me this stuff. What kind of video do you think it would be? Um, yeah, it would be awesome to be able to get a, a video with this stuff and prove me wrong on some aspects of whatever it may be. Uh, but the fact is, is I'm not a fan of it. And until I can do what I said, I'm not doing it. I don't give a shit about KHWs. I want to know about RPMs and I want to know about how fast my 250 is going to go and where I need to be at what time and make sure I can make it back. That's just how it is. You know, that's kind of me. Um, but the integrated touchscreen, I think is cool. Being able to right there, being able to see that stuff and change your stuff. Um, they do have a good throttle system, I saw that. I mean, everything they got is nice. I think it's well built, I think it's quality products, but I'm not a fan. So there you go, Jordan, what do you think of that? Is that good? Yep. You got anything more for me? You want me to comment a little bit more, talk about anything? What about America, what's America want? Besides, this is your final opportunity to get the Smoke Series. Smoke Series t-shirts are gone after today, so if you have not ordered, you need to order today. Today, uh, he'll probably give you through Sunday to get your order in. But if you have not gotten your order through the weekend, come Monday, it's gone. The next series is going to be Andy on it. So I'm gonna be on that next series and we're gonna see how that sells. It's gonna be not just my face on it, but I'm just gonna say, I'm gonna design kind of what I want for my next style t-shirts of series and we'll see how that goes. So the next series will be Andy series and um, they were pretty cool. I got some ideas, different styles, different things, and we'll see how that goes. But today, through the weekend, is your last time to get Smoke Series. Make sure you guys rocked it. We got a lot of them out. It was great, but they're going away. They're going away on Sunday. I don't want to see them no more. They're going to go away. So if you haven't got one, make sure you get one. Right, Jordan? What else you got? All right, so the, we're, you know, Jordan's actually right when we're talking about this. This is like first edition electric stuff, guys. This isn't like probably the end of the world, obviously. This is like Ole Evanrude putting around in his first ever Evanrude. This is like 
Gen 1. This is like, here, here's motor number one. Let's see how it goes. That's where you're at on this. So this is obviously gonna get better. Mercury's on, Mercury's building them. Yamaha's building them. Other brands are going to build them. It's just like cars. Tesla did their thing, Chevy. Everybody's got an electric car now, so everybody's probably gonna be in the outboard world, start building electric. That's the way it's gonna be. But is gas gonna be gone? I don't think so, not in my lifestyle, but while I'm here, but I may die tomorrow. You never know, you never know what could happen. But um, it is what it is, that's how it is. We appreciate it, I hope you comment. Make sure we're commenting on here about this. We wanna talk about this, make sure other people are seeing it. Share it to your buddy, share it to the guy that you hate. Make sure he gets it, because we want him to say something about how he is pissed off about electric. That's what we wanna hear. All right, so that's what we wanna hear. Maybe these guys out there that have some of this vision stuff, comment, give us some stuff. Let us know what y'all you're doing with it. Um, at the end of the day, I'm not a fan of it. Um, Neil loves electric, he's really a fan of it. He's, he's gonna ride in his 20 mile an hour boat all the way down to mid pool before it runs out of juice. Um, but yeah, at the end of the day, it's all cool, it's good. Um, comment, subscribe, click notification bell to witness the madness. Hey, wait, Jordan, Jordan? Yeah. Jordan, we are rocking it right now, are we not? Yeah. Like we are climbing through the mountain tops, like we're on, we're on the, uh, we're on the, we're going, we're, we're going at like full climber speed. Yeah. Um, I think in the last, through the last couple of videos, you guys have just destroyed it. What's this, what's the last one on this nitro versus the world one? I looked at it, was that like 10 or 12K? Am I wrong yeah, there? Yeah, might be close to 15. All right, so I mean, this that thing, that's crazy. It's a week old and it's 15K. We used to do a week and we had a thousand. You guys are awesome. I cannot thank you enough. You guys rocked out all the Icon stuff and that's still going up. It's still on the climb, it's crazy. Um, if Icon, make sure you're checking out Icon. Make sure you're going over and checking that out because that's coming uh, Bassmasters Classic 23rd, 24th, 25th. 24th, 24th, 25th, 26th. Um, in Knoxville, they will be at the Classic if you're around that area, go check that out. But you guys are just rocking and rocking and rocking what we do, we appreciate it. Merch sales, commenting, the subscribing, 100,000 plus more subscribers in like the last, I don't know, week or something like that. It's amazing, you guys are awesome. I appreciate it. Get on the merch, get over there, check some of that stuff out, buy some more stuff. We did sell a pair of flip flops, correct Jordan? Yeah. Drop the flip flop. Everybody went and picked up flip flops. That's right, there's flip flops on there. You should go get yourself a pair. Um, go get a flip-flop. Let me know you bought a pair of flip-flops, I'll love it. The person that bought a pair of flip-flops, I, I want him to comment, that person's awesome. I appreciate the flip-flop buy, all right? That's a big time deal for me. All right, make sure you get over there, check out the merch, subscribe like we always do. We appreciate you, couldn't do it without you. I could not do it without you guys. You guys are number one. Um, yeah, season's starting up here in Wisconsin, so we're getting ready to rock and roll. That's it. As always, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell to witness the madness that the electric outboard people are now saying, speed, money, no brakes. Does that work for electric? Yeah. Just, that speed part's there, it's 100. 109. 109, that's it, we got it. Yeah. Vision Marine, all the way electric, 109 mile an hour. Speed, money, no brakes, comment. Appreciate you, I'm out. See you.